everyone, Cheeky Tam here and welcome to another taste test. Today, thanks to the lovely Paula who lives in Canada, I'll be trying Doritos Roulette and Collision. <laughs> now when I received this box, I thought, wow, Paula has sent me knives. Isn't that interesting? But then I thought, no, why would Paula send me knives? Not that I wouldn't want knives. I mean, because I like to cook, not because I just want knives. I don't want you to think that I just want knives. Oh, what? What moved? I have heard of these Doritos roulettes before and I've heard lots of different things about them. One of them being I was scrolling through my Facebook one time and I saw a news report that these Doritos roulettes are really dangerous. And I don't know why I clicked on and read the article because I thought, you know what, I might actually try those in a taste test one day. But the first thing I read was a little girl said, I thought I was going to die. It might have been one of these hyped up news stories and there was also another friend of mine that shared this thing about these roulettes things being dangerous and that no one should be eating them. How bad could this be? And now I'm slightly terrified of these. I mean, they're just Doritos. I'm assuming just a hot Dorito. I should be able to handle it though. I'm a grown ass woman. Because of that, I got prepared and I got myself some water. Just, just a little bit of water. Oh. I didn't bring a glass up with me. Apparently all of these Doritos look the same in size, so you don't know when you've got the hot one. Uh, yes. There you go. Can I tell the difference? I'm just going to grab some out. Uh, a lot of them are all crushed up, so... Yes, I guess it won't be a lot of a hot Dorito I get to have. Let's try and get a couple of full ones, or no. I can't even get a full size one. How hot could it be? I do not know. Can you tell which ones look hotter? I personally think that one's got more flavour on it, so I reckon it's tricking me, and that isn't that hot. And I reckon this one that looks more plain is hot. I also think that this one is not hot. This is the one I think isn't hot. I'm scared. <laughs> I'm really, really scared. I don't think that's a hot one. <sighs> I might suffer a panic attack during this. This one, I think is going to be hot. It's not. That one didn't taste the same as the first one I had. Not hot. Okay. <laughs> I think this one's gonna be hot. That one tastes slightly spicy. Is, are these just not that hot? I don't know. This one tastes a little bit spicy, but you know, I, I kind of was expecting to run for water actually and tip the whole bucket over my head or something. I think this is supposed to be the hot one. Oh yeah, it is a bit spicy. Hello. <laughs> Hello, it's kicking in. Oh yeah, there it is. <sighs> no, it's not that bad. I think because I've had pretty hot and... Oh, hello. I've had some pretty hot and spicy things doing these taste tests, so my tolerance has built up or something. This is the hot one. Oh. And this one is not hot. So they say that you can't tell the difference in the colors of them, but yet I pick the hot one every time. Watch out everyone, I'm psychic, but only when it comes to corn chips. Actually, I quite like those little spicy ones a little bit, you know, but I like them. I don't mind that. What was that? Mind you, I did have to actually eat quite a few Doritos to get the hot ones, and so it's made me thirsty. I don't have a glass, I'm sorry. That's how we drink our water in Australia. We don't bother with glass. We just get a big old jug and suck it out of that. Doritos Collisions. I've never heard of these ones before, so I'm really excited to try these. What does it say? It says habanero, what, what, what? Habanero piment, fl fl <sighs> seriously. Habanero piment fondro yant. Seriously, why are they just making up words? I'm hoping half of the chips are gonna be this color and half are gonna be this greeny color. So I can either get habanero piment fondro yent, I think I said that wrong, or guacamole. Have a look, are they different colors in there? Please tell me they are. Look at this! I mean yes, yes they are. So you get half guacamole and half habanero. Let's try the habanero one. 
Oh! Sorry. <laughs> I didn't know what habanero was. <laughs> so it's a slightly spicy Mexican sort of chip. I think that habanero one's just as spicy as the one in the roulette one. Let's try the guacamole one. Yep. Doesn't really taste like avocado, it just sort of mainly tastes like sour cream. I mean sour cream everyone. And I think the best thing to do though is to try these together. when you eat them together they're good so after all the drama of the roulette doritos i was expecting like a world of horror and i didn't get it attention some chips very hot not really they are hot but like they're not going to kill you or anything i mean there's no need to write a news article story i didn't actually read the whole article i just thought i'd better stop since i was going to eat these i actually quite like both of these they're nice and spicy i would actually just sit down and eat these i wouldn't care if like randomly i got one that was slightly more spicy I i'm okay with that thank you so much paula for sending me these doritos and there's more things to try and hear from canada and america i actually i took some of them out of the box so it actually just looks like i showed you an empty box and there's something in here too which i haven't even looked at yet maybe that's a knife i'm australian so I'm allowed to pull it out and go, that's not a knife. If everyone in the comments below could thank Paula, because without her, this taste test would not have been possible. Thank you so much, Paula. Mwah. Please remember to give this video the thumbs up and subscribe for more. Have a fantastic week, everyone. Bye.